Hey friends, it's Quenby, the Grateful Queen, here on YouTube. Welcome back! Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back! Welcome back. I think we are going to have a lot of fun in today's video, and I really hope you're going to learn something. Today I am doing a boho thrift haul, a big Northern California thrift haul. And I want to talk to you and share with you about everything I know about selling boho bohemian clothing online. I've been an online reseller for almost 10 years. I've been selling clothing on eBay and a few years on Poshmark. And one of my best selling categories is something called lag and look. I'll be sure to explain that to you. And also bohemian fashion. So I want to tell you what to look for if you want to sell boho fashion and make some good money off it. Anything that I can put lag and look in the title is going to sell well for me. What is lag and look? Maybe you've heard it, but you're not exactly sure. I'll be sure to pop up pictures. Lag and look translates to layering look. It came out of Europe and it's really popular in places like California, but other places too. It's all about layering. So think of like the coolest art teacher you can imagine with wide leg flowy pants, maybe a skirt or a tunic on top of that. Maybe Maybe a, a layer and kimono on top, a big chunky necklace, lots of layering, lots of wide leg ruffles, anything that looks kind of artsy. If I can put lag and look in the title of a piece, it's going to sell for more for me, especially on eBay. So I want to tell you everything about how I list these lag and look or bohemian pieces. I'm going to give you a lot of keywords and style terms so that when you build a title on eBay and Poshmark, you know how to make a title so that customers can find your bohemian stuff. Okay, so we're going to talk about brand, styles, colors, fabric, all that. This is a perfect lag and look piece. Um, and it's a great brand that sells well for me as well. The brand is Soft Surroundings. They make a ton of bohemian fashion. Um, this color, which is chartreuse, is really popular with people that like artsy boho um, fashion. This is also a long tunic. So you would wear this um, layering. So you might put your wide leg pants under it. You might put another drapey piece on top. So this is long. It's a great color. I'll use the keyword tunic for sure. It's also a good size. This is a large and a great brand. So a fantastic boho piece. I wore one of my favorite boho brands, Free People for You Today, and it's got tons of embroidery. So let's talk about embroidery. When I'm looking for bohemian fashion, embroidery is huge. So sh let me show you a few of the embroidered pieces that I got. This is by Style & Co. It's a size extra small and it's a tank top, but look at the heavy embroidery on that. All that detail work. Boho fashion is all about embroidery, crochet, lace, ruffles. So these are all great keywords to use and things to look for. Style & Co. is a brand that does great for me, but it's not like it's super high end. I bought this more for style. Some more embroidery. I love this piece so much. I wish it would fit me. This piece has everything going on for it because the brand is Lucky Brand. Lucky Brand makes a ton of great um, boho pieces for sure. Look at all the heavy embroidery around the neckline of this. This is like a boho dream. Now I would call this another boho keyword that's peasant top. So for this title, I would put Lucky Brand Women's Top extra small, heavily embroidered peasant top. It's got those bows on the sleeve. It's just so, so good. This is sort of oversized and it's sort of a boxy fit too. So this is like a perfect boho piece. I'm gonna show you this piece even though it's totally not fitting into my boho vibe, but I was just so excited to find it. So this is the brand Vince. This is one of my best selling um, brands on eBay in terms of like, it is such an expensive brand that it sells for a lot. So it's Vince with a period, not Vince Camuto. No, that's something totally different, Vince. This I paid $10 for. It's just a women's shirt dress, like a gray, a gray shirt dress. But this brand is amazing and it happens to be new with tag. I've only found new with tag Vince one other time. It was a sweater and it sold for me for like a hundred bucks. Come on camera, focus, focus. I paid up for this like 
brand new, amazing Canon N50. It's linked in the description section if you think you're ready to like upgrade your camera. I love it, but I'm still learning how to use it. It's like a real camera where I did everything before on my phone. So not necessarily a um, boho piece, but an awesome brand I wanted you guys to know. Here's another type of boho and lag and look piece. The brand is J Jill, which is still one of my best sellers over on eBay, but this one's pure Jill. So you're, you always want to look for um, not just J Jill, but J Jill's collections like Pure Jill, where they use the best fabrics or wherever collection or Love Linen by J Jill. Those are the ones that you wanna look for. Now this is a super boxy fit. So part of the lag and look style is like a boxy top like this, maybe with some wide leg pants or a long skirt or something. So boxy fits are really great for the lag and look. Um, so I got these at a church thrift store, which is one of the ones in my area that's still actually affordable. Um, short sleeve tops were $3.75, long sleeve tops were a dollar, pants were $3.75. Um, I stayed away from jeans because they were six, which is still cheap around here because my Goodwill charges 10 for jeans, 10 for dresses. So um, it's worth driving all the way across town to get this um, little bit of lower prices, which I know for a lot of you, depending on where you live in the country, like um, that's still pretty high prices, but for me, it's low. Low, 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 low. I like keeping my prices low. In case I forgot to mention it or you're newer to the channel, yes, I put my bloopers in at the end of the video because I make a lot of bloopers and I used to try and edit things and make them all nicey nice. And then I was like, Quimby, you're a quirky girl. You cannot help it, you're going to make bloops. So the bloopers are at the end of the video. Stay till the end to catch those there so we can laugh together and have some fun. Friends, I wanna take just a minute to make sure that you have subscribed to the channel. We would love to welcome you as part of our reselling community. I do a ton of reselling education videos, hauls, unboxings, and a live show every Friday. So be sure to Subscribe, turn on the little bell, that way you get notifications when a new video comes out or I go live, and subscribe, bell, like, you got it. So here we go again with the J Jill. This is this is everything, this top, because it's J Jill, it's Love Linen, which is one of the, one of the um, brands that sells really well, one of the lines within the J Jill brand that sells really well. Now, if you want to sell bohemian boho stuff, you're gonna be looking for linen. Linen, 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 linen. Us boho girls love linen. So this is everything because it's J. Jill. It's a size 1X plus size in this particular brand does great. It's a boxy top and it's linen. So almost anything linen you can put in your title, lag and look, and help people like me who love that style and boho fashion find it for you. So I pick up, come spring and summer, almost everything linen. This is probably my favorite piece in the whole haul. I haven't had a chance to look it up yet, um, but I bought it for style. The brand, it just says wrap. And you're like, why'd you buy this brand wrap, Quimby? You don't even know, you didn't check comps. I bought it because of style. I know I can sell this on style alone, whether I find out whether this brand is good or not. I love this piece so much, it's going to be hard to sell. Again, boho perfection because it's linen, it's sort of boxy, and then look at the embroidery. Also notice the colors. Yes, there's that chartreuse green that I showed you before, but a lot of these muted earthy colors are really good too. This is a gorgeous piece. I can tell it's high quality too. Look at all the pleating detail in the front, and then look at the covered buttons. These are all details that are more expensive for someone to make. Just please don't try it on, Quemby. Please, please, because then you'll want to keep it and you need to sell things. I'm going to show you a few other things I bought at the store. I did do this boho haul with you guys in mind, but I couldn't help picking up another thing. I paid $8 for this because this is a genuine Carl Lagerfield. Lagerfield? Carl Lagerfield. Someone will correct me. And that's okay. I bought this because it's a designer. It's in a, like, it looks new. It is in gorgeous condition. It's a Paris-like graphic designer sweatshirt. I also bought this silk joie top. I love this brand joie. It is so expensive at Nordstrom and they're known best for their silk blouses. This is 100% silk. Silk is a fabric that sells well and that brand like for career. 
Okay, back to a couple boho pieces. Um, so this is that brand Soft Surroundings that I showed you earlier, that first chartreuse top. A really great brand. And so keep your eye out for this brand. It is expensive kind of catalog brand. Look how gorgeous this is. Look at the floral, gorgeous color. So this is a tunic. Great for layering boho romantic fashion girls. Look at this cool detail at the neckline, how it's sort of slit there. Now I'm kind of a curvy girl. I just, I don't think I could get away with having like, you know, a panel right there, but it's kind of a neat look. So this is a great brand, great tunic length for boho, and it's a linen um, blend. So fantastic boho piece. Okay, I gotta show you a few other amazing brands. I really did well this day. I'm so thankful. Are you thankful? If you are listening to this or watching this video, take just a minute to stop and say, what am I grateful for? What am I so thankful for? When you are in gratitude in your mind and in your brain, it is impossible to also be discontent, dissatisfied, unhappy. So it's a trick I use all the time, doing my gratitudes all the time whenever I think of it. It can be little things, big things. I hope it works for you. This is a brand that is amazingly trendy right now and the brand is Acne Studios. Mostly I see their jeans. This is a total bolo. So these are a pair of high-waisted wide leg pants. Super on trend and they're new with tags. I looked really quickly at comps on eBay and someone has these same pants up for $225. Sold comps are in the over $100 range and I paid eight bucks for new with tag, kind of mom style Acne Studios pants. Yes, yes thank, you thank you very, very much. much. I got this J. Crew sweater, size large. J. Crew's been selling great. Again, kind of a boxier uh, tunic length, and this is a color block sweater, and it has kind of an open knit. I got this while I was waiting in line. It was just sitting on the rack, and I saw the Lululemon symbol across the room there. This is a men's size, extra large uh, polo. If you're curious, I could do a whole video. Let me know if you want me to on Lululemon, how to find the tags and the styles and all that. But on this one, it's on the bottom here, XXL. So on the bottom inside hem. Okay, I got this great maxi dress and I got it because it was camo not necessarily the brand. The brand is Crescent Drive and comps didn't look great on this brand, but this is a long camo maxi dress. If it goes all the way down, it's a maxi all the way to the floor as opposed to like mid calf. Camouflage sells well in everything. And this has got these high slits. So you could layer this with leggings, a long necklace, I mean, it's super soft, fantastic, size medium, large. Camo, get yourself camo. These are the wide leg pants that I keep talking about and they feel like silk. So we're looking for the wide leg silky pants. And also these are like tie dye, which is like, what can be more boho than tie dye? These feel like silk to me. So just to do a quick review, some of the things that you're looking for when you wanna get the best boho stuff or lag and look stuff to sell, wide leg pants, uh, linen as a fabric, tons of embroidery, crochet, lace, ruffles, anything that looks kind of romantic, anything that can be layered, boxy tops, tunics, long skirts or dresses, um, so those are some of the keywords you can use, some of the things you can keep out your, your eye out for, even almost regardless of brand, because you can sell things by brand, but also by style and keywords. So I hope this has helped you. I've had such a fun time sharing my boho haul with you because it's fashion that I love. Be sure to subscribe, like, and all that kind of good stuff. Bye-bye, bye-bye, bye. Bye-bye, bye-bye, bye-bye. Bye. Love you guys. See you in the next video. Bye. Hmm. I think like the, could I sit, should I sit here? Then I think the light might be off because there's this glare. Okay. Oh, well, I just can't be a perfectionist. I just have to get it as best I can. 
Welcome back for layer, no. Lag and luck. Okay, let's try and set this up. I don't love this background. So I did a haul, I did a, no, I didn't do a haul. So maybe I need to get a little closer. And maybe a little bit angle this way, but then I'm a little off. Hmm. Yeah. All right, that'd be great. Yeah, bye. Here's another um, education point. Here's another tip. Tips for selling clothing online. Tips for selling boho, bohemian fashion. How many times can I say, how many times can I say boho? Boho Bohemian Hippie Lagging Look. Boho Bohemian Lagging Look. <laughs> Seriously.